So, palm here. This is a very interesting battle that I'm about to have to do here. So, I skipped ahead a lot. I just finished up Radimus' gym and got to the point just before the boss fight. Uh, I've actually run this fight a couple times just to test out how things work. Um, let me double check, make sure I'm recording. Yep. And I actually found a very uh, decidedly bizarre win con in... Of all Pokemon, Flareon. Because Flareon knows Curse. And, uh, to put it simply, this guy runs a Trick Room team. And considering I'd be boosting my own attack, and even once the Trick Room goes down, I'd have Quick Attack and the Quick Claw. I really do genuinely feel like that could be a thing, so... Okay, that Reuniclus just popped Magic Code, so I can't status it. Um, I I just ran, like, a couple different things to see what would happen. Um, I could try to sleep the Glade and just kill the Rayu. Okay, so I can't kill the Rayu with one hit in one hit. Burn it though. Okay, the Glade is now drowsy. It, it close combats me. There is the trick room. Okay. So here's the thing. Um, Glade is actually going to be quite fast now. I'm gonna pop my first curse. And I'm going to switch into Thick XP because they're about to use Psychic Moves on me. Oh, that's why it's moving so slowly. I didn't have speed up on. Okay, so now Thick XP can start trying to, um... Okay, now here's an issue. Slow King. Even at minus one, even if I were to drop my IVs to zero... This slow king is still faster than Flareon and will Oko him with Scald. Go try and finish off the Oh yeah, um Psychic does rock type damage for some fucking reason in this field. Um okay, so let's just This is just feels like such a weird thing to rely on, but I think either Flareon is the play, or the play is once again Cosmic Power, because, um, holy shit, this is gonna be a rough one. This is gonna be a rough gym, I, I, I can tell you that much right now. Okay, so, Psychic, oh my god, that's just one shot. Okay, now, neither of these things is toxic. I guess I'll try and, like, bullet punch the Rayu. Okay, so I bullet punched the Rayu. They're scald. He's still alive. Malamar. Uh, I can't remember. Is this Malamar? Contrary superpower? Um... It is. It is contrary, it has a brave nature, it has reflect throat. Ooh, throat chop. That's a bag. That's not good. Okay, yeah, it's a bit of a kill, but I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep fucking potioning. Um I have absolutely no damn clue if there is still trick room up or not. So I'm just going to try and close combat into the Malamar. Okay, no, Trick Room's still up. Full, full force. 
Okay, so now I have to try and solo an entire gym with just a... Nasty plot, and that's how much fucking Dirt Chop does. Okay, you know, I need to reset. Um... Now... I do unironically just hate this field, because... Like... They try to just completely deny you the ability to use Taunt. Which I, with the seed in the fields, because like here, um, I actually think I have it in game, so I'll just pull it up in here, but this field is loaded with bullshit, chessboard. So, chess attacks, ancient power, psychic, strength, continental crush, as you can tell, additional 50% power, they deal rock type damage for some reason. And they do double damage if you have Klutz, Oblivious, Simple, or Unaware. And so it's a good thing I have Moody instead of Simple on my power right now. However, Adaptability, Anticipation, Telepathy, Synchronize will half the damage of these moves, which is weird. Um, so Calm Mind or Nasty Plot becomes... It goes without saying, like, those saddest moves are going to be insane. Full stop. Um, Trick Room lasts 8 turns, that's why it didn't fade. Um, Fake Out, Faint, and Faint Attack do more damage. Faint, faint Attack could actually help there. Uh, I don't think you can have Sarina at this point, and this is the only place in the game that this field shows up, so the Queenly Majesty thing is kind of useless. Here's an interesting thing. It's destroyed by Stomping Tantrum. Normally, this is just a thing that I advise usually when just playing through the game, is pick up a Primeape, because you can catch it not long before this, and when you use Primeape, it learns Stomping Tantra by level up, and so you can use that to just completely destroy the field. Nature Power becomes Ancient Power, which is worthless here, because I don't have anything that can even learn it. Secret Power will draw the target's defense. Here's a somewhat interesting one, though. Boosts special attack and applies magic coat. And so basically any status moves that get thrown at you will just get immediately bounced back. So what I think I'm gonna try to do is this. Instead Alright, so I'm going to still pack, drop a PK, but instead of leading off with the doof. Okay, it does have Shadow Ball, but I can boost my special attack much higher than he can, so. I basically have to try and kill the Gallade, which apparently has Destiny Bond, like, with a single hit, so... This might take a few tries to just get right the strategy right. But this is a very interesting gym. Alright, so... Instead of going straight for cosmic power, I'm actually going to open up with Calm Minds. Um, that didn't kill, for fuck's sake. Okay. Well, I have Mach Punch. That's, this is, this is why I have priority moves. Um, and then I believe most of my really good, wait, I have a 90 thing instead of a 60. That, that'll work, like, half HP. Uh, it's, it was the slow rope before, now it's gonna be the Malamar. Slow King. Um. Don't know why I was thinking slow bro. But yeah, now this is when you just start to go match the shit out of Calm Mind. Or that fucking happens. Uh, okay, it's a reset. Um. I 
yeah, this is... I, I'm not quite sure what I can really do to break through this gym, because, like, I can't level up anymore. Uh, here, if I... Just real quick, check the... Wait, no, not that. It is further down. Here. So here's the thing of mods that I'm allowed to use. I don't think I can get anything. Except for maybe one thing. Vals are level 22. Halo itself is garbage, so that's... I just want to check what is it's... Oh, wait. It's not in Gen 8, so they don't fucking list the level up move pool. Hate that they made that change on the site. Here, so... 25 special attacks, nothing special, especially at this point in the game, but, like, stab boom burst. How does it get boom burst? Is it an egg move? It's an egg move from fucking Noivern. Okay, so... This... This is the only Pokemon that I can get. And the only way I really see this helping me is... Like... Okay... Maybe I can kill the fucking... Fucking, uh... What's it called? Gallade. I can kill the Gallade before. Like, because, like, most of this team is... His team is very bulky, very powerful. So, I'm, I'm going to keep trying a bunch of different strats here. Just, this is a, this is a tough fight. Okay, so here's the first big order of business. Um, rather than going for Flare Blitz, I'm actually going to immediately open up Shadow Claw and... Well, first I'm going to Curse. Apparently I'm faster than the Gallade, but that Curse will that let me live. No, it does not let me live, so that's an F12 moment. So, all right, cursing turn one does not work. Um, I already used my focus ash to kill the Dialga to, to kill the Arceus, so that's not an option. I have a couple more hard skills, but I don't think there's anything really valuable I could get from the move reminder. Um, I'm just looking through, trying to see is there anything that could be useful here. Um, Sky Plate will be useful for when I do get Swallow. Um, Splash Plate is worthless. Uh, I have a lot of, I have a lot of stuff that's just supposed to be sold and not stuff I can actually use. Um, I should save that weakness policy. There are fights where I think that could be useful. Damn, there's just nothing here. Like, nothing useful. Except for maybe the normal gem. Like, here, I won't save before it, but... Um, I'm gonna try... Giving the normal gem to Ice Beam. Wait, that's only... It's only 10% more than the Silk Scarf anyway, that wouldn't actually do much more damage than Return is already hitting for, so I don't think that's particularly useful. Okay, so my... I'm not bothering Flare Blitz, I don't want to take the recoil and... 
it also will let me build up power on my attack against the Slowbro. Why did that use Flare Blitz? I selected Shadow Claw. Okay, I don't know what the hell happened there. I used Shadow Claw. Alright, so... It, it really doesn't help that this is a doubles gym. <laughs> Just... Double battles are, are where this game really lets us get brutal. Okay, so now... Shadow Claw! On the Ray Uniclis. Oh, my Flare Blitz. Okay, no, I was seeing Flareon use Flare Blitz. Okay, I'm just dumb. Okay. So now there's a Slow King. looking that I now have to promptly try and one-hit KO. So, let's try. Okay, the metronome boost definitely helped there. So now... I lose the doof. Okay. Um... My special... I don't have spe much in way of special attack, so I'm gonna kill the Gallade, and I'm gonna try and high jump kick the... Okay, so Gallade's just- that- that's dead. No more Gallade. Fucking reflect. Okay, and now this is- Time to do something really boring. Okay. They have zero EVs across the board. They only have the- they just have perfect IVs. Pokemon damage calculator, uh, clear my custom sets because- finish that game already. So, um, Infernape. I already know this isn't going to kill because fucking Reflect is up. Um, alright, I have plus attack nature, 24 IV, and 149 EVs, so... IV of 24, I, let's just say adamant for the sake of it, um, my level is 60. Against a level 56. A level 56 bulkless metagross. Using Shadow Claw. My item is a metronome. I have used this three times. Even without the reflect, this wouldn't kill. So here's the question, what's stronger, that with the metronome boost or just the flare blitz? The answer is just the flare blitz. So, I'm just gonna go on for Flare Blitz then. Um, okay, and I'm gonna keep trying to fucking kill this Malamar. Okay, that still did a good chunk. I missed... Fuck. And he has fucking healing items, so... Okay, I need to call mine. I need to try and fucking high jump kick this bitch. Yeah, he's, he's an asshole. He's just a bona fucking thighed asshole. It's not dead! It's not fucking dead. Okay, so. Cosmic power as I. Suppose returns doing the most damage? How many potions does this asshole have? Okay, he only had the two, which are already gone, so... <sighs> Fuck, those hits still really hurting. <sighs> okay. 
Okay, so... This will be an almost full heal. <laughs> Metagross still going for fucking Meteor Mash. Um... Reflect is still up, so even if I tried to... Okay, I have three cosmic powers. I want one more calm mind, and let's get baby doll eyes off of Metagross. Clear body. I forgot about that. Okay, calm mind. Um, meter mash miss. Reflect is gone. That is what I want to see. Okay, now it's hidden power, and let's return because Gardevoir has <laughs> poor defense. That that was probably the. Th Single most fucking unnecessary crit I've ever fucking seen. Um, okay. Uh. I had progress that time, but. Okay, so the first part of that strategy worked. Okay, so... Just... Yeah, there's, there's no beating around the bush. This is going to be... I, I knew this was going to be one of the hardest fights in this run going into this. Just because of the mom's roster and it's already difficult on its own. Okay, Shadow Claw, Flare Blitz. Okay, there's the Claw, there's the Blitz. There's the dead cat. Okay. Okay, the Doof. Shadow Claw. Crunch. Okay. There's there's the close combat. We we knew we were gonna see that, so now I still have this calculator open, so what level is this Malamar? Fifty-four. Fifty-four Malamar. So Malamar. 54. Okay, so... <laughs> These two hits together... Might be enough to kill. Won't kill. It killed! Oh my god, I got a high roll! Um, okay, so now, yeah. Okay, I think that crit mattered, but... Wait, no, now I can't break the fucking Metagross. Okay, Gallade. Uh, it's holding it just a... Uh... Level 53, Muscle Band. I think that's just ten percent boost the physical moves. I want to say. Oh, for fuck's sake! That crit matters. <laughs> that crit definitely mattered. Okay, so just. I guess this is just how some of these fights throughout this run were just going to have to be. I've known this was going to happen. Just reset after reset, resetting mid-fight, just find what works, what doesn't. This game involves a lot of experimentation, and with such a limited pool of tools, this is just how it has to be. Alright. Turn one. 
pieces go on to the board and we make our opening move. We sacrifice one of our pieces to take out one of the most important pieces on the opposing side. Now, we sadly must sacrifice a second piece, more of a pawn in this case, for the sake of striking down another bishop. The knight kills our pawn. And now, with our queen hitting the field, working with our own knights, we pray. We pray for a good roll. Okay, no crit. We knew that crit mattered. Trace plays. Okay, I feel like no matter what I do, I'm probably going to lose in Fernape this round. So I need to try and kill the Gardevoir right away. Because, at the very least, if I can get this to a... Okay, wait. Okay, I'm losing him to... Oh my god. Does this Metagross have Bullet Punch? It doesn't. Okay. And now... The opponent is in check. The opponent is in check. And that check is now about to be made. Uh, I, I don't really know what I can do with this thing, honestly. Uh, just psychic. It's, it's high drop kick. The play is high drop kick. I missed! No! Okay, chest piece slammed forward. Zen headbutt. I'd make another chess joke, but chess is a game that doesn't have RNG to screw you over. Chess, every mistake that you make is going to be your own fault. I miss. I mean, I guess that's going to happen when you're relying on a mom with high jump kick as your main stab. You're going to miss eventually, and so now we just have to keep... Keep beating away at the horse. This horse ain't dead yet, but... <laughs> shit, man. Okay, and now just... Apparently I'm faster. I, I should live this mash. Okay. A quit will ruin this, and I'm calling it right now. I'm gonna get crit eventually. Just... Uh, I think I have an... Uh, I, I, do I have an ice hand? I, I don't have any way of curing freeze. Okay, now I have to start throwing up calm mines. Okay, now I'm at max special attack. Um, okay. 
Alright, first let's see how much Psychic is doing. Three AKO. And there it is. Checkmate. That was a good battle. That was... A very good battle. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm sorry, I need a moment. I love it when that happens, just, you have to, you just work out the perfect strategy, and then even when it went wrong, even when we got the miss and almost ended it, the thick is to be pulled through. Cosmic Power and Calm Mind is such a fucking good combination. The... The only thing I can think of is I want a move that can break through the Psychic Resist, like... Shadow Ball. <laughs> oh god, that was... Okay, so... Now there's pieces in the middle of the boards. Okay, this guy leads us into a trap. It reveals that he, the Pope, has not been mind controlled. Then a Nido King comes out of nowhere, and we get to run outside. Okay, so we get that. Our level cap is thankfully increased because we were just about to go past it. Um, we just got the TM for Trick Room. That move can single handedly break this game. Because most gyms are not at all equipped to handle it, especially the double battles gyms. You can do a lot with just that one move. Okay, so there is one guy that we can fight while we're here. Uh, figured we might as well. Can I just kill, please? You're able to click Shell Smash, so. And it's not fucking raining now, so... Fire moves are actually hitting with their full power. He's the only one you can actually fight, so you get Radimus right here, he reveals he is not... that he is in disguise. Now he, he, he conjures a staircase... And I actually do think this is pretty cool. There's a... S oh, wait, no, it is raining. How did I not notice that? There's a second maze on top of the hedges. And I, I think... I, for one, think this is really cool. Like... When I first played, I was like, Oh my god, it's interconnected. Just, I... It's a really neat little thing. Now, uh, you can get an encounter, uh, a fight here, uh, with this bitch, so, let's do that just for the sake of the EXP. Alright, so, jump kick. Yep, that's gonna... Oh, well now it'll definitely kill because this thing's so slower than me with the shell smack. Oh my god, it was actually faster than me! Does it have swift swim or something? That should not fucking be faster than a Lopany. Okay, Crobat next. Uh, easy opportunity for a bit of. Okay, and now more. It's faster. That's not unexpected. I mean, I am six levels above, but my speed slot's still abysmal. 
But now... That was really good, and really important, because now... We can get three new Pokémon, including finally a water type! Not Route 3, I meant to get Route 1. Uh, I just need to see, where do I get the ta is Taylor on this route? Um... Because, where it was? It's in the forest. Um, okay, well, uh, we don't care about that right now. I'll catch it before going to the point of no return, because I, I definitely feel like a flying type will be useful. Especially against the flying gym and with something as fast as a swallow. But, more importantly, the, there's two other new Pokemon. Um, there is Empoleon, and there is Alakazam. Um, so much as I like this party, um, I feel like Alakazam is gonna have, I feel like the thickest B is gonna be dropped in favor of Alakazam, because I already have two Psychic types. He's a good option to have for boss fights, but like, the speed and power, like an immediate power of Alakazam would be much more useful overall. Then the um slow setup that the thickest B has, but the thickest B is still gonna be incredibly valuable. Don't get me wrong. He's just gonna be an option that I fall back on for boss fights. And then I'm just gonna keep Toxic Sight around as like a sort of second wall breaker. Because, like, just having a second fighting type is, is just nothing short of wonderful. Okay, uh, which way do I need to go? I think it's just further right, even further left, honestly. I have to get back to Reborn City right now, because... It's the criminal underbelly that we're going to. Here we go. Alright, back in town. So now... Probably gonna look up where I can get a new heart scale, but... Because, uh, Nature Changer. I almost have enough to hit up the Nature Changer, and he's like the next thing that we unlock. Oh, did I not do this yet? Okay, apparently I never freaking beat the Magma Gang. I could have fucking sworn I already did this. Oh, you know what? I'll turn animations back on, actually, because, like... There, there's not going to be a bigger boss fight for at least a little while, so... Game's kind of in low stress mode right now. Oh, and a flash fire, okay. Battle scene, that's what it is. 
Okay, you just ignore all of these fuckers, go straight to max. <laughs> Given the level gap, I don't think this is gonna be difficult at all. As a matter of fact, I wouldn't be surprised if everything was a one shot. Out of the way. Yeah, I know there's some other hidden items in here, but I don't feel like looking for them. Okay. So now I run back here, talk to... I, I don't want a fucking Carvana, I can't even use it. Um, okay. So now we can get to 7th Street, which is one of the best places in this entire damn game. Okay, so... First things first, um, I... Actually, wait, I think there's a PC just down there, so... Uh, we're getting a new move for Pain Split. It is the move that is his namesake, so he's actually very much going to be useful. And welcome to 7th Street. So there's a couple trainers here. Uh, this guy sells ability capsules, which uh, I'll take just one because you can buy more at the circus. So not going to have any issue there. Okay, well, good thing I knocked him into Zen mode, then. So he has one Zen mode and one Sheer Force, maybe? No, it's just both Zen mode. Yeah, I'm probably going to turn animations off whenever we get around to fighting Team Meteor because the, the animation for Shell Smash in this game takes, like, without speed up, it takes just about an actual real life minute, I think. Uh, I don't think anything there is particularly useful. Um, I'm just checking, like, all the tutors um, Spite, Worry Seed, Magic Coat. Uh, yeah, nothing, nothing here is particularly useful either. Um... Fuck, does this guy sell? Uh, oh, it's a lot of mon-specific items. Oh! Uh, I'll actually take one of those, because... Maybe let's stick with the metronome for... Infernape, because he clicks a lot of different types of moves, but for Flareon, that charcoal will actually be pretty nice. Uh, nothing else here is useful. But, uh, charcoal, that's a, that's a pretty nice little thing to have. Oh wow, it's the ugliest mon in all of Generation 7. Bruxish sucks. Like actual donkey dick. Oh, let's put Toxic Side up front. I'm, I'm trying to only give EXP to the people that I know are like definite staying on the squad. Uh, Lapin is actually probably gonna get dropped for. Okay, so we talk to our resident bomb salesman. He's selling blast powder. I'm gonna get like. Eight. That's it's it's fucking expensive, but I have a lot of shit I can sell. Okay, so now here's the big thing. There's a lot of mods here. So um, 
what I'm gonna do is you have to deal with a lot I'm just gonna try and get all the trainers in here out of the way but um, I'm trying to get to a PC just so that I can drop off a mod that I know I'm not gonna be keeping probably PM um, and then start soft resetting for good IPs um, we can get Abra um, we can get Ditto, which we only really care about a good HP IV on him. Actually, wait, I am allowed to get, use Ditto, correct? Yeah, I am allowed to use Ditto. Ditto is cool. Ditto is a cool Pokemon. He'll be, he'll be nice to have. Okay, so is that do I have to fight any of these guys? No. Okay, so this is the I think they call it like the watering hole or some shit. Uh, that's where you go to get type null, that little shadow right there. Uh no, I didn't even see what fucking move it was. Uh, after you snatch magic room. One of these guys tutors pain split. Nope. Telekinesis. Uh, Ally Switch is a delayed priority pivot in this game. But, but no, none of that's useful. Yeah, this guy just sells. I'm. I'm curious. Is there anything else I can use that I can actually learn? Explosion that has a competent attack stat. Like, Ray Uniclus can, but. Uh, Duosion. Duosion does not have an attack stat. Lately, I'm never gonna use Lately though, so. Okay. Well, unfortunately. Oh, wait. I think my thing must be set to Genate or some shit. Pinaco Fortress. Cargo. Okay. Oh, those are, those must be, uh, Catmons. Fuck it. Why not? TM-64 explosion. And that is useful because... I don't know, maybe I'll need to make a Glalie's refrigerate for something. But alright, I think it's time we start... To, um okay well I should divide these things into uh, actually have some relevance um this just doesn't belong in this box let's put the thickest B here let's take his lax incense There is a way to get him pain split. I know there is. And okay, let's go. Pack here. Apparently I don't have enough for it. I should have enough for the Abra. Fuck. How many purple shards do I have? I have three? Okay, well, I might not be able to get any of them right now. I, I should be able to farm for those pretty easily. No, for the love of God. Uh, ice punch. Alright, with this, it's annoying that this place has actual trainers in it. Okay. That's that.
Okay. Um. Okay. I think I need to talk to. Go into here. Get a drink. There we see Bennett. Um. Okay, so he's gonna come running over to here. Talk to him in here. Uh, I don't feel like doing any more trainer battles in here, so. It's not there, it's here? Yeah. So, saving the people who got kidnapped can fucking wait. Um. We need to get a pip look. Okay, purple shark, that's good. I, I need these. Oh, come on, where are all of the fucking... Okay, oh, so... I'm going to bet it was just a stupidly well hidden heart scale or something. Okay, but now we can loot this a second time because that's worth picking up. Let's try like uh, water stone. That's worthless. Okay, uh, it's an iron ball. So, okay, this rock was mostly a dud. At least I can sell this shit. But here's the important thing. We find some hard drugs. So now we go over here. We get robbed by a crack addict. Now I have to fucking find said crack addict. I believe it's you. Uh, I forgot to save before doing this. Uh, if I have to, I'll just go back a save and redo some walking around to get the fit to get to the point where I can get the IVs, but. Beating this guy gets you a pip whoop, which, uh... To say the least... We really want a pip whoop, because, uh... Water and steel are two types I don't have yet. I need something that can actually resist flying. God damn. Oh, it's Haxorus for you. Okay, well, it hit itself, so that's fine. Okay, so now that's that. Okay, so... Okay, that guy gives you the red candy back, so... Now there's another guy suffering from crippling addiction somewhere in here that we gotta find. By finding him, that's how we get the pip. So I don't actually have to really say if that's good. Okay, so that's that. That is him dealt with. Okay. It's... it's someone. I think it's you? It's not him. 
I think I might be purchasing one of these alcoves on the, off to the side. But I'm not ending this episode till I get a fucking Biblop. Uh, I think it might be this. Oh, fuck's sake. In between episodes, I'm probably gonna clear out the rest of the trainers in here. Get some EXP onto. Okay, so now it's. There's a guy who. <laughs> it's it's kind of dark. You literally give it to him to further f fuel his addiction, but like. You? It's okay. He wants money. What the fuck is this guy? That's the dude who robs you. Not him. Okay. bad for her. Uh. Uh, this is the nature changer. <laughs> That's type no. I don't think I can use that. Uh. It's this guy. Okay, so. Boat, because that's what the joke is from. All right, boat, level 15, that's, she has me a little bit running. Okay, shit IVs, but uh, thanks y'all for coming. I'm going to be doing some soft reading settings, some grinding, some hunting for items off camera. I'll see you all later.